holy nostalgia, and gifted fans something they never knew they needed. The R&B icons joined forces for a TikTok duet on Thursday, February 18, recreating the intro of their 1998 hit. The brief video featured the pair lip-syncing their parts, beginning with asking, Excuse me, can I please talk to you for a minute? The clip ended with the Moesha alum snapping her face. She captioned the post for Instagram, he he at Monica Denise, heart, hashtag the boyisman. The 40-year-old Angel of Mine singer, for her part, simply tagged Instagram handle on her post along with a black heart em. As shared the post via TikTok, she wrote, love you mo with a red heart. She captioned the post, this was fun. Hashtag the boyisman. Originally released a solo version of the TikTok video for Valentine in a hashtag on her post, she asked her followers to duet with me. And released their iconic Grammy winning track 23 years ago in May 1998. It served as the lead single from the pair's sophomore albums Never Say Never and The Boy Is Mine, respectively. Years later, the duo reunited for his 2012 song It All Belongs To Me. The viral TikTok of the boy is mine comes months after and teamed up Bruh for Zeus battle in August 2020. Though they used the live Instagram show to harmonize to their respective hits, they also took a moment to address rumors of their past beef. The pair claimed to be on good terms with each other despite having not been in contact for the last eight years. I wanted to speak to you face to face, the why I love you so much singer said. The more we're talked about, the more it came to be difficult, unnecessarily. And I really really am a straight shooter and I really do admire what you've done musically and what you've had to endure. The Cinderella star said that she has the utmost love and respect for her frequent collaborator, adding, for somebody to start at 12 years old, the longevity of your career, nobody, knows, what previously shut down rumors of a feud with during a HuffPost live appearance in 20 people are still asking, who got the boy? And there was no boy, she we played up the dramatics of it all, but we were 16 and 17. There was no boy, no beef. The Georgian Ada then explained that it all stemmed from brilliant marketing to promote the people started creating these skits, and then our fans, became, divided, and it became this real thing, she recalled. But now as us being adults, it doesn't exist. Makes amazing music, so why would I tell a fan of mine that you can't support her? It's really frustrating. I am a huge supporter of everyone in the business, especially.